Hi all, welcome back to our vision board community. So today we are introducing our community member Reshma. Actually, she's the highest package in our community and she achieves a lot of things in our life. So I will introduce Reshma to our community for vision board. She will motivate you and she will give you some lot of information when you're preparing the interview, when you're depressed or any state, she will give some kind of motivation. Reshma, welcome back to our vision board community. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you so much, Devi. It's a pleasure being here. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> so I owe you a big thanks for everything that I've achieved right now. Like at least for my really thanks to God. Really, 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 <laughs> yeah. Thank you, God, for uh, rooting me to you as well. Thank you so much. Yeah. So uh, stating or starting with my journey, like I actually yeah. it's been almost uh, five months that I actually was looking out for a job and I was uh, uh, mm -hmm. not getting a proper one. I was not landing up in a proper one. So uh, mainly because they were looking for a cloud experience as well. So that's when I contacted Devi. I wanted to learn more about Azure. So I, in in so my main primary skill set is uh, EPL Informatica Power Center. So uh -huh. the point is that uh, I was getting interview calls for my primary skill set as well, but I was not getting through it as well. So mm -hmm. the one that is the best choice connecting with Devi was one of the best choice uh, because. Um, it's not only about how I learned my uh, Azure journey with her. It's not only about the Azure journey, but also about uh, she helped me be consistent as well. See, even though in my primary skill set, I was unable to craft my interviews because I was just, uh, you know, the way I was learning it or my energy level probably was not good enough for that. But the moment I started joining with uh, Devi, the way she follows up with me, she helped me keep consistent. That was one thing. So currently right now, all I have done is only because I was doing things regularly, consistently, which helped me boost my confidence. Mm -hmm. That confidence level was reflected in my interview. I had three rounds of interview and uh, one was uh, verbal, one was written, and the other was a behavioral uh, round with the manager. So okay. everywhere, like in all the three things, um, I was able to crack it because before that I had a hard work or consistent hard work set for myself. Mm -hmm. with constant pushing from Devi so, and everything because of that I was actually able to achieve it so what consistency does with it actually helps you boost your confidence and it, it comes in naturally you know you, you just give out an interview even though how much ever you are expertise you just give out an interview randomly and if you are actually consistent and prepared and then you give out there is a difference it makes mm -hmm. a lot of difference yeah and it has actually it's a feel good also you know when you start uh, you know having a good confidence you actually start feeling good when you start feeling good they say according to law of attraction you start you know the universe starts giving you whatever you want to whatever you feel right mm -hmm. so yeah that's the basic thing that's what i believe yeah, Deshma, actually, when you attended a lot of interviews, right? So you can yeah. think like that energy level. So when you yeah. uh, talk about high energy and when you talk about low energy, you can feel the difference, right? Yeah, you can really yeah. feel the difference. Like uh, uh, basically when you are, um, see, when you're consistent, right? Automatically every day your confidence level is getting better. Till mm -hmm. the time you actually reach where you start feeling good out of that confidence. Uh, but the day when you are not consistent, what happens is like you have a stagnant confidence level. Okay, mm -hmm. that is not going to probably help you for uh, a longer run. Like if you want to get more, you have to be consistently raising your energy, which happens only when you do. It's like you're basically hitting the gym. Like if you want to reduce, you have to do it regularly, and then one day you will see the result, and then that is what will inspire you to go to the next. Uh, you know that will that your result on your body will actually help you to go to the gym every day. Mm -hmm. If you want to see the result, you have to be consistent. Mm -hmm. So that's all. Yeah. So and knowingly or unknowingly, that, that adds to the confidence. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Because most of the people don't know these kind of things. I think when I talked with a lot of people, they depress, they don't have, but they already have power. But sometimes they need some kind of push and some exactly. kind of motivation, exactly. some small motivation correct, to keep their life, right? Right, right. So that's what even your, uh, the one beautiful thing I found was, uh, it's not only Devi is not only focusing on, um, on the technical part of your life, but also when she sent me the link for the five-way interview, 
trust me if i had no difference in the esc and e, uh, iest timings i would have definitely left to join but otherwise seeing the people doing everything actually it inspires you and it really makes sense you wake up in the morning you have a lot of time to do you have a lot of energy like um, it it really matters a lot you have you get a lot of space to work and you have a lot of things to be covered that also mm-hmm. adds up and mm-hmm. yeah waking up in the morning the energy level in the morning is actually different comparatively to the day mm-hmm. so yeah it actually exactly. helps a lot because when i started my journey also i was a night person but when i wake up in the morning and the late i didn't get much time to organize my entire day and then that time i got the miracle morning that book i read so that was the one book i think i'm suggesting to you also right deshma because whatever oh, whoever sure. i'm really loud i'm just suggesting that book to everyone because when we wake up at 5 am or 5:30 we will get more time to exercise and doing these things and all that also good then yeah. up skill in the morning time we can use up skill mm-hmm. correct correct so even though i'm not i have not yet reached 5 am but at least i have made sure that i i sleep early <laughs> in order to wake up early i try my best but at least one i see small i believe in small baby steps so yes. earlier i used to sleep late at least now i have targeted to sleep early and mm-hmm. if not 5 at least i am waking up by 7 <laughs> i am i am trying to reach there like mm-hmm. basically i will reach there but i am being consistent that is the one thing yeah thanks so much when you are sharing these kind of information people also because in our group also when you achieve the success they are also very happy because uh, people can get these kind of motivations and all it will more helpful and also you already yeah. mentioned there are for four or three rounds of interview then without yeah. the confidence anyone cannot crack these kind of difficult interviews yeah. and all yeah, yeah. Okay. so and yeah. interview was also good or how was the questions also why how you think like that um, so basically they wanted to see uh, that how is the way we apply logics or mm-hmm. you know the way we can achieve so it's not really about how technical we are but how is the way you are, how are the, the the way you are thinking so they are testing yeah. your logical mind as well so first the first round of interview they were actually only giving me questions related to the technology like if mm-hmm. i know the basics and all and mm-hmm. uh, some a few scenario questions also they gave second they mm-hmm. gave me a document like after a few days they gave me a document and uh, they sat in the mid hr was sitting with me in the meeting and okay. uh, they asked me to solve it while i was there so they gave me a uh, time frame of 1 hour so in 1 mm-hmm. hour it was all a uh, complicated scenario based most of them were sql unix uh, most of them were sql and unix so mm-hmm. i had to basically type in and send it out in an email uh, in a document i have to attach and send it in an email but by meanwhile all the time the hr was also looking over and and because mm-hmm. of the time myself or not so yeah and the third was a managerial round when they found of okay, the technical round was clear then the managerial round they were uh, looking for uh, in this scenario what is it that i'm how i might be behaving so they mm-hmm. gave me some context on how would you address a client how to face a difficult situation when the client is coming in like uh, you have a deadline to meet and mm-hmm. uh, we have a change in requirement so oh. what do you do how do you handle the client because you are the thing is that you are here facing the client you have no excuse so mm-hmm. like you have a lead or somebody who can actually cover for you or anything you are telling mm-hmm. you are answerable right so mm-hmm. it's better you come up with a very good thing uh, because sometimes it's very hard to offend a uh, you know a client here mm-hmm. so that's the thing mm-hmm. right so yeah. you have to be very careful on the choosing the words and putting out mm-hmm. things how to explain mm-hmm. so mm-hmm. the way so you have to be very elaborate on what you're going to say so i have prior experience working under pressure projects Then mm-hmm. the client always is dissatisfied, so I have had this such clients. So I was lucky enough to, uh, you know, crack it through them. Also. Mm-hmm. So yeah, that uh, one. So three rounds of interview, and that's it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, actually, right. So, uh, so it is really good, and we are really happy because our vision board, me and vision board team, and every member in the team is really happy. Definitely, your gift will be sending soon. Oh, <laughs> thank you so much, Devi. Yeah. Just one more uh, thing I would like to add up to people is like always, uh, uh, a healthy mind remains in a healthy body. So mm-hmm. I would request everybody to at least um, do some kind of a physical activity, because when when you're doing a physical activity, it might be walking, hitting a gym, or do anything. But what happens mm-hmm. basically is your blood circulation increases. Mm-hmm. Okay, it's not stagnant. So the more your blood circulation is, the more active your brain will remain. Mm-hmm. Okay, that will make you less lazy, and that will make you more consistent. 
Mm. That is one thing you should always uh, try to add at least fifteen minutes of some mm. kind of exercise. Just take a yoga mat. You can do it in your work also. You just mm. don't need to hit a gym. Do it, but please do it. That is the really thing. I do. I did it consistently, like for two, three weeks. Mm-hmm. I was working out as well. I uh, as well. She was pushing me constantly to uh, using the forest app. Also, I was doing it. So I, I am not a, a person who gets self inspired just by this. So Devi was my inspiration. So basically, because I was, I was feeling obliged that okay, Devi is being responsible for me. I I owe her that responsibility. I mean, she is taking responsibility for me. so i felt obliged and i was doing it by myself uh, okay i have to send her an update i have to do this so i had to squeeze in everything out of my household work i had to squeeze in time and i made it a point mm-hmm. so yes so that that is the thing right so yeah so main thing is consistency exercise this is what i would say and rest leave it to the god yeah. even if you might not be able to crack it or even after consistent work if you are not able to crack it until that means that is not the right job for you mm-hmm. you land up only in the right job so mm-hmm. never feel uh you know like this qualified even after consistent if you're still not getting a result then mm-hmm. that is not the right opportunity for you that's it mm-hmm. yeah exactly actually now coming to also there is a five way group that is free for everyone so whoever want to join you can also join with us because as a community me reshma everyone was there actually there are lot of success stories also you can see in the group itself so it is like a uh, happiness mind and we will get uh this kind of happy news of when we hear every day our mind also become happy that yes. will attract lot of good result to us right yeah. at least seeing yeah. that every day that is what your subconscious mind works based on what they yeah. see rather than so the things that we skip in consciously is actually recorded in your subconscious mind so it's mm. better always even if you are being a part even if you are not actively doing things but if you see that every day mm. one day your mind will start Thinking, why not do this? That, that it is a psychological thing, basically. But it will work. It that is a big, part of it, at least. Yeah. They are telling like based on the community or based on the family, or we will decide our character. Yeah. So when exactly. you in this kind of community, what will happen? Our energy level will be caught up with those kind of people. Mm-hmm. So that will give you extra motivation and energy. That is very true. So yeah, yeah. birds of the same feather have to. I mean, like basically, it's your tribe that decides you, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Thank you, Reshma. Anyway, Thank there are lots of things will be come to your life. Definitely, I know. So keep this energy. Every time you need to be constant, and we need to be more flexible. In next time, I will be taking an interview. You will be next highest package or next highest position in there. Okay. So I think uh, okay. team, okay. I'm what is okay. actually we have a vision board community. I'm just sharing. After three or four months, we can take one more interview from Deshma. So that time she will be a good position. We can say like that. Hopefully, I make a switch soon. <laughs> yes, yeah, sure. Okay, sure, sure. Yeah. Thank you so much, Devi. That was a really thank you so much for all the support.